All right, this tutorial is for the online version of SketchUp to get you going with the SketchUp assignment. So you're watching this video, and before I set you free to watch this create a house video, I just want to show you a couple things. One is saving your project, and two, a couple using a couple of tools that he, he assumes that you already know. So we click the link, we end up here, we go to start modeling, click this guy. You have to be patient on that last screen. It takes a little while, so I paused the video until uh, mine came up. And then, so anyway, um, just a few minutes ago, I started one named House Tutorial. You're just going to go to create new one, feet and inches. By uh, by default, it's set for this. So hit create new. It takes a minute because it's the online version. And before we start drawing, I like to delete the person just to get them out of my way. I just paused it and I rotated a bit so I can zoom in and out. But it's going to be easier if I show you with the rectangle drawn on the screen. So I'm going to go ahead and draw a rectangle. One thing I want to point out, he, he shows you in the video, but he goes over it really quickly and doesn't explain the feet and inches. So I'm going to click once. He tells us to do that. Um, and then he tells us not to click the second time. He says, look down here in this window down on the bottom right, and it's displaying your dimensions by feet and feet and inches. Feet are with one um, quotation mark, and inches would be two quotation marks. So like right now it says 52 feet, 3 and 15 16 inches, comma, that's one side. The other one is 5 feet, 9 and 5 eighths inches. So rather than click, I'm going to go ahead and just type in on my keyboard and look at the bottom right corner of my screen. I type in 20 feet. Now I have to separate them with a comma, so then I put, down, put in a comma. And if I type in 30 feet, now I can hit enter. And there we are. I'm zoomed way out, but it's um, 20 feet by 30 feet. Okay, and now when I use my orbit tool, because this is what he doesn't show you and I want you guys to be aware of, this orbit tool is really important to get used to and play around with, so it's worth taking a minute or two just to sit here, just to draw your rectangle, your first rect rectangle, and just get used to moving around orbiting. The other thing to get used to is your scroll ball. Wherever the your hand or your tool is on the screen, that's the focal point, so notice it zooms in and out toward that point. If I put the point here, I zoom in, zoom out with my scroll ball. And that's really useful to know that you can zoom in and out in different locations. Grab your left mouse, click, and orbit. So once you get familiar with that, uh, then keep going. And so I want you guys to name this one as right here house tutorial so right down here you name it house tutorial save it and it's going to put it in your project files on their website so that the next time you log in it'll be there all right so and so i'm going to be grading this on your screen so i'm just going to come around this you don't have to send this to me or email it to me so next step is watch this video create a house and finish the house as he does just copy exactly what he does and then i'm going to let you guys modify making your own project it could be a house or something else but um i'll give you instructions on that later for right now just copy what he does to get used to the tools